now with that bachelorette bombshell. Current, current bachelor star and high-powered attorney Rachel Lindsay will be the next and first African-American bachelorette. We're going to hear from her in a moment, but first, take a look at her journey. Hi. How are you? From the moment she stepped out of the limo, the bachelor was smitten. Rachel has really good presence. She's obviously very smart. She's beautiful. And she just, right now, stands out to me. Giving her the first impression rose in two romantic one-on-one -on -one dates. I might be breaking rules here, but I'm super into you. 31-year-old <laughs> attorney Rachel Lindsay from Dallas, Texas, an instant front runner for Nick's heart, winning over the rest of Bachelor Nation with her confidence and poise. I'm 31. I want a man in my life. I want a companion. And I want a big family. I love kids. You know, I'm ready for that stage in my life. Please welcome our next Bachelorette, Rachel Lindsay. She may be ready for love, but in the bombshell announcement Monday night, Rachel revealing to Jimmy Kimmel that she doesn't find it with Nick. But her relationship with the show is just beginning. This is a bit of a spoiler, because you're still on the show. Yes, it is. But you know, we're a couple of weeks out for filming. We're ready to get this started. I'm ready to find love, find a husband. She has this charisma and this charm that you just want to be around her. Bringing brains and beauty to the table, Rachel will also be the first bachelorette of color in franchise history something many fans have been waiting for. It's not the fact that she is the first African-American bachelorette. It's that she should be the bachelorette, period. And that's what I love. And it is great to have the new bachelorette, Rachel Lindsay here. Welcome to the show. Thank you for having me. And congratulations to you. And, and you couldn't say anything about this until last night. So what has the reaction been since you've gotten it out there? You know, I, I haven't been on social media, so I haven't seen that much yet, but the cast members that I was on the season with have been great, giving me mm -hmm. great, you know, congrats, and family and friends have been wonderful, too, so it's, I'm just glad I don't have to keep it a secret anymore. Yeah, that, that's got to be a pretty hard thing to do, yeah. it's, and, and you're on the current season, yeah. which makes it, like, it gets, you're now they're going, oh, she's a bit, but it's still going, a little spoiler alert for most people, mm -hmm. but when you were first asked to be the Bachelorette, were there any hesitations on your part, or did you just say yes, absolutely? No, I mean, I'm, I'm a skeptical person, so I was definitely, I was excited that I, mm -hmm. they asked me to do it, but I was also equally nervous, but then when I started to weigh out the the pros and the cons, I decided that this is too good of an opportunity to turn up, you know, away. And you are making history. You're the first African-American bachelorette. Mm -hmm. And how does that make you feel? That you added pressure, you think? I don't feel added pressure. You know, I'm honored to have this opportunity and to represent myself as an African-American mm -hmm. woman. And I just hope that people rally behind me like they did in Nick's season, the same way that they, or hope that they will in my season. And uh, just realize that my journey is you know, I'm just trying to find love, and even though I'm an African-American woman, it's no different from any other bachelorette. I'm just a woman trying to find a man. Just trying to find a man. <laughs> so you get it. You Notting understand Hill, me. Baby. Hill. You I understand love that <laughs> And, uh, and on that on that home hometown visit episode with coming up with Nick, I got a little sneak peek at that. And in that, um, your mother asked him how he feels about being in an inter interracial relationship. Now, did you know that conversation was coming? I know my mom, so I'm, I, <laughs> I am not shocked that my mom asked that. Um, you know, my my sister is married to a white guy, and so it's it's nothing new for our family. Mm -hmm. And she just wanted to make sure Nick was comfortable with it. And, um, and, and one more thing, what is your, and, and I'm pretty sure a lot of people, what is your favorite and least favorite part about The Bachelor? Because I think a lot of people have some misconceptions about the show. I think it's all just fancy trips and fancy dinners. What yeah. is your favorite and least favorite part? Um, least favorite part was living in a house full of women. Uh, yeah, yeah, sharing a room with that many women. I mean, I was in a sorority. I haven't done that in years, so that was definitely my least favorite part. Um, my favorite part were the surprises. Uh -huh. You know, um, the friends that I made on the show, um, the relationship that I had with Nick. I didn't think that we would click the way that we did, and I really enjoyed the process that we, that we had making our, you know, relationship grow. And now we know the track record of the show. Mm -hmm. How are you going to avoid some of the past pitfalls? You know, I, I, I said this on the show all the time. I just like to keep it 100 and keep it real. So I just figure if I just stay true to myself, mm -hmm. then, you know, it'll be a successful show. More so than that, stay true to yourself and you find the right man. That's, That's how right. you do it. There That's we go. Right. Rachel Lindsay, congratulations Thank to you. you so very, much. very happy. And Rachel makes her Bachelorette debut when season 13 premieres on May 22nd.